one! Cannonball! I hereby declare you captain again! Feel free to go down with the ship! Bye! You are too kind! Hola, my dudes and dudettes! This hot banana is hanging there! Mommy! <laughs> huh? Dog, oh, come on! <laughs> Want something done? Call the thin crust with extra cheese! Wait! Epic wave, right, guys? Guys? <laughs> You're not gonna hold all that pirate stuff against me, are you? <laughs> we were just having fun, right? <laughs> having fun now, meathead? Because I'm getting a joke out of this. Wait, wait! It's not my fault! This is old Ricardo's idea! My condolences, my foolish footlong friend. But we are powerless to deny the law of the Chucky Mark C. Buenas noches! Yep! Yowdy! See ya, matey. Like 30 seconds, but who's counting? Ah, every food for himself! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Land ho! Land who? <sighs> Land here. Hola, landlubbers. I am the renowned and oh so irresistible a Capitan Ricardo. Welcome to my noble vessel, the SS Numero Dos. You call this soggy diaper a vessel? But of course! Behold! The sails are made from the finest snotty tissue. Now, my delectably fragrant sea dogs, hoist the hairnet! So sweet, yet so dumb. The big net over the side. Dump it on the poop deck and be quick about it. You are wanting a ship. Well, now we have the greatest ship on the Yucky Mart Sea! Ooh, we got another bite! Well, what are you waiting for? Reel her in! What took you so long? I thought I'd never get rescued! Ooh, it's Meathead. Let's throw him back! No! Let me stay! I'll sweep the poop deck! I'll even poop first, then sweep it! <laughs> Unhand that sandwich! I, Capitan Ricardo, says that Meathead stays. Oh yeah? Well, I say he goes! This tub needs a new captain! And my wood-fired crust and delicious four-cheese blend make me the perfect choice. So it's mutiny! I will see you walk the plank for this, my foolish friend. Ooh. Oops, my bad. All hands on deck! Start bailing! Ah! Plug that hole! I am too handsome to be waterlogged. Are we? <laughs> over, pizza breath. Now walk the plank. <laughs> Your betrayal cuts me to my fear. But perhaps we are too harsh, eh? My new companion? Yeah. Why don't we talk about this over a slice? My treat. Let me think. Nah. Sorry, matey. It's the law of the Yucky Marcy. <laughs> I will have revenge! Huh? You! <laughs> get away, uh, fingers! This pizza ain't for nibbling! That is what you get for messing with the masterful Capitan Ricardo. Right? First mate, meathead? Actually, I only saved the ship so I could take over. <laughs> As of now, this ship belongs to Meathead the Pirate. 
And you're me squishy crew, Ricardo. Yar! Now, hoist the pirate flag! Aye, aye, you brutish one! Swab that poopy deck! Hoist the snot sail! That too! Give me some refreshing juice! And it better not be kiwi! Raspberry onion, my face. Now, scrape those barnacles off the hole! I do not think that is a barnacle. It's Doc Brock. Same diff, scrape him off too. Oh, come on! Fine, there's plenty of other ships in the sea. That takes care of that. Yeah! Enemy ship! Full speed ahead, Ricardo! Prepare for battle! Yar! Aye, aye, my capitan. Arr! Aye, aye, Capitan. But may I ask, who is this Davy Jones? And why is his locker located at the bottom of the sea? His gym shorts must be most soggy, which could lead to chafing of the tender regions. Stop yapping and start pirating! Ready, I fire! <laughs> How's that for a free punch? Nah, nah, miss me. Uh, miss me again and again. <laughs> now he's really got me charged up. Well, what are you waiting for, Doc? Return fire! Eight saints, you pirate poop heads! <laughs> I can go all day! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> no one defeats pirate meathead! Hmm, oh. refreshing! Time to break out the good cutlery! As my beloved grandmother used to say, there's no stank like pirate booty booty stank. It's garbage, get him! Give him everything we got! Charge! Prepare to be boarded! No one shipwrecked my ship but me! Shiver your timbers at the fearsome meathead, the pirate! Hello! Evil pirate talking! Oop, we're sunk. Ugh. Hands off, Rocky! I called dibs on the last soda! Yeah, after I saw it first. Well, it's got my name all over it. Last time I checked, your name wasn't Scuzzy Cola. Uh -huh. Give it. You give it. It's mine. No, mine. <laughs> Let go. No way. Uh-oh. Hey, who turned out the lights? I am mucho afraid of the dark. Hey, Ricardo. How's a new job? It's a living, my footlong friend. How do you like that? Ricardo hopped on the soda. Quit slacking, Ricardo. I'm paying you to do odd jobs. The odder the better. Not to stand around blabbing with Riff Raff. Now get to work. <laughs> Baroom! Ricardo, stick your tongue on that fly zapper. Thank you, but no. I'm on a strict no insect diet. Do it or you're fired. Very well. Since you asked me so nicely. Did I say fired? I meant fried. I dropped a tooth in there. Find it for me. As you wish, boss. Blah. Hey, what is this? A blotto ticket? Perhaps my lock is about to change. Huh? Blotto ticket? ticket? Mine. Oh, mine. Give that. You give it. Actually, the ticket is mine. You see, the finder is the keeper, and the losers are the weepers, who get fired and flushed. <laughs> To scan or not to scan? That is the million dollar blotto ticket question. What are you waiting for, Ricardo? You want to be a squishy toilet brush for the rest of your life? Blessed mamacita of chance! 
My ticket is the big winner! Oof. I am no longer what the poets call flat broke. Enough celebrating! Now that you're filthy rich, you gotta learn how to look and act rich and filthy. And I'm just a classy guy to show you how it's done. For starters, you're way too pale. Wealthy folks love their fake tastes. Hmm, this time does not smell fake. It smells banana-y. Whoops, better turn up the heat. We're late for your hair appointment. But I do not have hair. You do now. <laughs> no. Not even. Oh boy. No. <laughs> uh uh. Perfect. Some unnatural color and a spritz to achieve maximum helmet hair. A tornado couldn't undo that, too. As I always say, the peel makes the banana. Ah! I'm in my banana birthday suit. Hey, who is this dashing fruit? And what has he done with Ricardo? Now for the icing on the cake. Aftershave. I mixed it myself out of prune juice, pine air freshener, and rusty pipe water. Oh, yes. I positively reek of success. I am a new banana. Now, big on ah! peasants. I am too rich to associate with the likes of you. I taught him everything he knows. So proud. <laughs> The frosty slopes of frozen TV dinners. Soak up the sun under a blazing tropical heat lamp. Gaze upon the most gl glittery jewelry in the entire Yucky Mart. But that's nothing compared to the squishy towers. A colossal condo of double ply toilet paper. Or the double squish ranch and its herd of thoroughbred race roaches. W welcome to lifestyles of the rich and the disgusting. I'm your host, Serge. All these wonders are owned by the world's richest banana, Ricardo. His peel to riches tale is the stuff of legend. Join me now for a peek at R Ricardo's high-priced, trend-setting lifestyle. Ah, muy picante. Let the interview begin. Ricardo, you live a life of glitzy gluttony. What more could an overripe tropical fruit ask for? Excellent question, my television companion, but definitely not my real life friend. What more could I ask for? Hey, how about my pedicure over here? Right away, boss. Gotta keep those rich, rich tootsies trimmed. <laughs> I have many rich banana things to do, but still I stay in touch with the little people. Like this ever ripening fellow. Don't give me that hoity toity fancy talk. I was rich before your bunch even fell out of the tree. <laughs> I had it all friends, music, and all the stale chocolate coins you could eat. <laughs> but I lost it all. Betrayed by my best pal and my best gal. <laughs> what I'm saying is, don't trust nobody. Excellent advice. Everybody out! <laughs> Too bad, so sad. Come back when you're rich like me. I'm not sure that's the moral of my story. Or is it?